It's Friday, and that means it's time for another episode of Ask the Expert with Rob Sutherland. Rob, my first question to you this week is, do you think people should worry about the U.S. banking system? What a great question. You know, I think there's a lot of people wondering what's going on with the banking system right now, and especially in North America, what's going to happen. Up here in Canada, we haven't seen the same kind of problems that the U.S. has had, but I think there's always going to be ebb and flows with a recession with things like that, where you kind of got to stay ahead of things. Like, I would definitely start researching your bank now, make sure that they're set up for insurance, make sure they're set up to cover their depositors and things like that, because you never know what could happen. It's true. You never do know. Now, do you think that the Silicon Valley Bank failure effect will affect the real estate market? I mean, geez, you know, I would say probably you're going to see the mortgage rates increase again, maybe a quarter of a point or something like that. Like you and I were talking before, it would be weird if they didn't, you know, probably a great idea for people to think, okay, they might bump up a little bit to cover that off. Um, I think it's a unique type of bank as well. I think, you know, if you're going to, you're going to your local Wells Fargo, that's much different than working with Silicon Valley Bank, which was working with these companies where you're investing in, in startups and things like that and taking high risk portfolios and whatnot, much different than a local bank. So I don't think people need to really compare that directly to you know their local bank that they use every day mm -hmm. and what can real estate professionals do to avoid banking issues well stay ahead of it make sure you you know do your research go ahead and talk to the different banks in town and see where what they're set up for when when the recession is looming and things like that are happening like if we're let's just say right now we're in the middle of a recession i would say go and talk to your banking advisor and see how they're set up see what they've got ready for people who are working as independent contractors or as realtors do you have some sort of a credit line you do you have some sort of a like a you know um, uh, ability to finance yourself if something happened to your business where you wouldn't be able to continue on anymore i'd say it's a great idea to actually dive deeper with your bank and find out more information about how they're set up. Terrific insight, Rob. Thank you for that. And for more information on PBA, just click on the link below, probrokeragency.com. Be sure to tune in Monday for another episode of Ask the Expert with Rob Sutherland.